You ever wonder why Call of Duty has been getting progressively, arguably worse over the past three and a half going on four years? Have you ever wondered why the developers seem to be so detached from the community doing exactly the opposite of what we want and when we when we speak out against it, they totally ignore us and just do their own thing anyway. They seem to be dancing to their own beat, you know, uh, totally detached from reality. And we out here wondering what the hell are they doing? Why are they doing this? What are they thinking? Well, you know what I was thinking the other day while I was walking the dog? I said, you know what? The reason that Call of Duty suck now and for the last three and a half years it's because Activision is going after that Fortnite money. Yeah. It all makes sense. It all makes sense. The game has been getting dumbed down. Especially now this year. They have dumbed this shit down to kneecap level. Hell, ankle level. The dumbest of the dumb could play this shit. The littlest of the little. And when I mean littlest, I mean the littlest. Listen. You ever wonder why the game have calling cards and emblems in it that look like cartoons that are made for babies? Hmm? You ever wonder? Like, never mind the unicorns and all the shit that's look like it's made for, you know, a 10-year-old. They got shit in the game look like it's made for infants and little-ass kids. So much of it in a game that's supposed to be made for adults. Am I lying? Is this game not rated M for mature? I mean, you gotta be 18 year old to buy this game. Why are there so much, why is there so much uh, artwork in the game that's uh, directed at children? I already told you, they trying to get that Fortnite money. You see, in 2018, Fortnite totally changed the game. They dropped a game that was free to play and then turned around and made over five billion dollars in revenue from selling microtransactions. Five billion. You know how much money Call of Duty made that year? About one billion. So when Activision seen how much money there was to be made out here, and in particularly with these little squeakers, because I mean, true. Let, let's keep it a hundred. I, I know you know somebody that love Fortnite. Hell, you with your grown ass probably love Fortnite. But look at Fortnite. That game is made for little kids. That game just totally took over these children's minds, hearts, and souls. And they had to get their hands on a parent's credit card to buy some skins to be cool. You know, kid parents love their kids and they want to do things for them and help them out. Give them allowances and shit. Your parents give you what you ask for if you're doing good. These kids and so and, and these kids get their hands on these credit cards and they get in a damn store and they literally go to fuck crazy on buying DLC shit because number one, they're kids and they're overwhelmed by the marketing and shit. You remember how it was when you was a little kid and they show commercials for shit on TV all day long? You had to end up, you got to have that shit. Same thing in this game, bro. They, you know, you log on to the game. They, they putting bundles in your face before anything else. You log on and you go directly to a fucking bundle. Because they trying to get that Fortnite money, bro. They are aiming at and targeting at these kids, allegedly. Look like to me. Talk to me in the conversation. Let me know if you feel the same way. I mean, look at all the things they did to make the game easier to play, right? And... It, it, it's, it's one thing to make the game easier to play, but it seemed like they was just making the game. I was totally confused because it seemed like they was making the game for complete imbeciles. You know, turning up the footsteps as loud as they are. And not giving us any type of dead silence perk to quiet them motherfuckers. You know, all of the shit they done did. You know, slowing down the entire pace of the game. Uh, what else did they do? You know, taking out the slide counseling little move. Giving you a penalty for jump shotting. You know what I'm saying? A broken mini-map. Random recall patterns I just learned is in the game. Uh, the big-ass porous maps with plenty of safe places to hide in. Streets that don't loop. Streets that ain't uh, good no more. 
on and on and on. Old school ghost park where you can just sit in a corner and not be uh, detectable. All of this shit was designed to make the game as easy to play for the littlest people as possible. Because at the end of the day, your kids to Activision is worth more than you are. Why make the game for you? When they can get way more of your money out of your kids way faster because they don't understand the value of a dollar yet. The pool of players that are new to Call of Duty that suck at the game is way larger than the pool of players who are good at Call of Duty, who love the game, and who play this shit all the time. They realized a long time ago that they can make way more money catering to noobs than they do catering to vets. We're at the top of the pyramid. You ever seen a pyramid? The top is very small compared to the bottom. That's why Activision don't care about you and, and, and your woes and what you're mad about and all of your complaints. Mine either. You know, I'm not excluded. They don't give a fuck because there's way too much money to be made by marketing to children on a game that's supposed to be made for adults. Is that shit not illegal? God damn it. Joseph! <laughs> it, it ain't his fault. It ain't his fault. You know, who, who runs Activision? Bobby! Bitch ass. But let me not cuss too much because YouTube out here demonetizing left and right. But man, it is what it is, bro. We can get as loud as we want. We can totally boycott the game. We can walk away forever. At the most, we ain't nothing but 20% if we join up. These motherfucking Fortnite kids are worth 80% of the money that they fucking getting out here. So until that shit changes, which it won't, because there's a new fool born every day, and when you get people when they're young, they're easily influenced, you know? Yeah, that's why gangs go after kids when they're young. That's why the military go after kids when they're young, all in the schools and shit. They want to get them while they're young because they're very impressionable. You know what I'm saying? You can shape them and take advantage of them. That's what they trying to do out here, man. God bless. Man, save the kids, bro. Ain't that fucked up? See, they know that you know the value of a dollar because you work hard for your money. And you know that these uh, skins and shit that they selling in the store is a ripoff. But a child don't have a clue. They don't earn that money. They don't know the value of a dollar. And that's why they make so much money when they market at kids and not adults. That's why they got all them silly ass skins in the store and shit. Trying to get that Fortnite money. They stole the Battle Pass system from Fortnite, the uh, Seasons. See, they realized they was rigging the wrong thing. First, they was rigging supply drops. But then they realized, shit, if we start rigging these matches, maybe we can tap into that $5 billion. That's where SBMM come from. And that's why the game suck now. But holla at your boy in the comment section, man. How the fuck y'all feel about this shit? Ain't that raw? It's the murder show, baby. Fuck with me. And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to pimp slap the piss out the like button for your boy. Leave me a comment. And be sure to hit that motherfucking subscribe button and don't miss none of this Call of Duty real shit. It's the murder show. Fuck with me.